think it just proves that there's, you know, there is something incredibly pernicious going on, which is that we ha- we live in a sort of culture of cowardice, which is that everybody, nobody thinks that anything can be resolved in a normal way amongst each other anymore. Authorities are brought in at the drop of the hat over everything. You know, the fact that even, uh, you know, a, a school would entertain the idea of external bodies becoming involved in a minor disciplinary action within a school grounds is insane. You know, it's, it's, well, it's not just insane, it's just an incredible abdication of responsibility. And, you know, the fact that, you know, people might see on, even on social media, someone misgendering and would decide to call the police rather than if you disagree with that have a row yeah. shows that we sort of have there's there's a we, we live in terribly antisocial times mm-hmm. i know it's christmas so i'm sounding really depressing <laughs> but i mean we do which is that we've lost the ability to rub up against each other to row with each other to defend social norms to each other the prevailing sort of narrative now is that the way in which social change gets enacted and the way in which social norms are enforced is by police officers and and by politicians and by law rather than what it should be which is that people police each other and that actually you know change comes from below is not enforced from the top down 